and like what well, exactly happened when she came inside of the house? True, like, did but, Gypsy yeah. open the door to you and like let you in? Like, she was obviously. Oh, yeah, she was deeply involved with it. I mean, uh, just like it says in his police statements, uh, like I said, right with while I was talking to them, it says just pretty much word for word what I told them. Uh, she uh, told me before I ended up getting there uh, in a text that the, there was latex gloves that be on the porch. She did say that. Right on the text is as clear, clear as day that you can actually see it. Uh, the, and then, uh, well, I ended up finding them when I got there, and I let her know that I was at the door. She opened the door, and she made sure I had the gloves on before she gave me the weapon, and she made sure that she wouldn't let me open the door. She made sure I had those gloves on before either of those doors opened. So that's the reason why you ain't going to see any fingerprints on in there either, any of that stuff. And then from that point on, uh, well, my darker part of me took over, and... Because she knew right away that I admitted straight out to the whole thing that I was not going to get involved with this, no matter how much she tried to push me. It was going to have to be a darker side of me of some form that I have never had the opportunity to explore. So I did not know what it was capable of until that dark night. Once that night came, I knew fully well what it was capable of. And at that point, there was no time going back because this... From the first step I walked into the house, I knew there was no coming back. There was two thoughts that came in my mind. One was a benevolent thought. Another one was a malevolent thought. It was almost like having a, a devil on one shoulder and a angel on the other. Basically, what happened was uh, I had one thought in my mind out of nowhere appear, and it just appeared. I didn't know. It was almost like, I guess you could call it God is what everyone likes to call it him talking to you or an angel talking to you through him maybe basically saying take her and run that was the benevolent thought take her and run as if it was a, a the kind of feeling that it was basically trying to influence on me as if i was somehow going to get away with it if i ran away with her as if somehow we were able to keep her mom at bay better than she was able to in the past when she ran away uh however the other thought came in my mind was because uh, it saw as basically because the darker part of me was also in love with the darker part of her. And because of it, uh, the thought was, is uh, excuse my French, but it basically said this bitch is dead. Uh, not letting her get between me and her, this bitch is dead, basically is what it, the thought was. And uh, unfortunately... I didn't listen to my darker side because I wanted to be with her and I remember what she said and I wanted to believe what she was saying and unfortunately I should have listened to my other part of me uh, as a, ironic as I was trying to influence her to go with but she never went with it. She never wanted to run away so I couldn't get that to work but anyways as uh, the whole uh, thing happened she ended up uh, as I was walking through the hallway that led to her room, her mom's room, and so forth, uh, she ended up going to the hall bathroom. Uh, she locked it. And I waited at least a minute and thought about if I really wanted to do it. And before I was to do it, allegedly, I was willing to do it. Uh, the next thing I know, I ended up going right into it and thought there was no going back because I already I had myself on my word. and. Uh, I was not one to break my word to really anyone at all if I had one to keep at the time. If it was worth keeping, I was going to keep it. And that's what led me Nick, to do it. Nick, the video is going to cut off in a minute. I loved her so but deeply that remember I Remember whatever you just did mind. to that thing. I and should we try it tomorrow? My word. Oh. Bye. Okay. Yep. All right. Sounds good. Bye. <laughs>